If you are interested in applying, we have a link and more information on these jobs on our website, abc10.com. For years, they took care of senior citizens nearing the end of their lives. Now a Northern California family is shifting their focus to helping those just starting their lives get through perhaps the most pain they'll ever face. Giacomo Luca brings us the story you'll only see here on ABC 10. Like so many children who have played with fire, not fully understanding the dangers, so did seven-year-old Santiago Ramirez Gallego of Cali, Colombia. Frank Breden of Pine Grove, California, rushed to the hospital when he learned what happened to his cousin, even if it was nearly 4,000 miles away. And so once we got down there and we saw the severity of it, we decided, uh, we both decided there was something we had to do. In the aftermath, Santiago would keep his life, but he'd have to spend months undergoing surgeries in a Colombian hospital. They just don't have the resources that, that we have here in the United States. After doing some research, they found Shriners Hospital in Sacramento that could do in a single surgery what took dozens in Colombia, and the medical costs would be covered. We flew him out here and he got the operation done. Santiago spent several months recovering at the family's 15-acre ranch and is doing much better today. But that's not where this story ends. But this is where the kids come and they play around and you have a, we have a pond down there with some, uh, with some bass and some, uh, and some bluegill. For several years, Frank and his wife Jackie have run a business caring for the elderly. They're now putting their focus on helping young burn victims heal. And it's, it's, it's heartbreaking to see some of these children there and they're just laying there in agony. And they started a Child's Hope Burn Foundation. For now, running it from a home office and in the process of becoming a nonprofit. The family's seeking funds to bring a second child from Colombia for treatment. Ten-year-old Nicole Mascara with severe burns from an appliance fire. We take so many things for granted here in the United States. We, yeah, we live in the best country in the world. It's, whether a lot of us want to admit it or not, we live in the best country in the world. And, uh, and I think we can afford to help other people as well. In Amador County, California, Giacomo Luca, ABC 10 News. The family has put together a GoFundMe for Nicole. You can visit our website, abc10.com, if you'd like to help.